should have seen that coming. Payback to hell. I've done really into it. We love these little blankets we got. Beautiful. I'm still like a, just a little bit dehydrated from last night. From last night, when you said, oh, you're exactly like my mother. You know, when you get That's married to somebody. That's a compliment. My mother was awesome. I mean, lately, we've been kind of like arguing a lot. Yeah, I agree. We, we need to find a place where we're not arguing in front of yeah. Julie. Yeah. It's, yeah. Just, it's, just not, it's just not right. And I don't know if it's because you know, when we drink, we fight more, or, or we, uh, what I, that is. So, you know, you have to talk out your problems and work, try to work them out, you know? Vicky's been telling me to try with Michael. You have to fix it. I tried to divorce. Divorcing isn't fixing it. You have to go to Michael and say, I'm at a crossroads. Michael's 57 years old. The guy's not going to change. I, I have to learn how to either accept it or not. Last night, I was trying to tell you, you know, have a conversation with you, and you don't want to listen, and you're like, bah, bah, bah. And it's like, why don't you try to just listen to me and say, you know what, Kelly, you're right. Or like, or maybe, you know, I'll make it better. Just say yes, right? No, I'm not perfect either. We, we both say mean things to each other, and it's wrong to yell and stuff in front of Jolene. I just don't want her to grow up thinking that it's okay for a man to talk to her like that. I feel I'm absolutely repeating the pattern of my parents. They stayed married for the children, but I did not see my mom and dad in love. Marriage is tough. I mean, it doesn't necessarily have to be. I really want Julie to see what it's like to have parents that love each other. And ultimately, this is what I really want for Michael and I. Life is, life is tough. I mean, you, you need a partner. The whole time we were separated, I missed you. You missed me. I missed Christmases and birthdays and not having Jolie full time. I'm pretty happy that my mom and dad stuck around until we grew older to get divorced. It might not have been the happiest family, but at least it was a family. I just don't want Jolie to hear us fighting. I don't understand why you, like, you know, like, want to fight me. I don't want you to get defensive. I don't want you to get mad. I want you to think about some of the things. Stuff. Right. Because it's starting to like wear on me and going, does he have cancer?